Austria has been a mainstay of the Formula One calendar, with its Styrian mountains providing a stunning backdrop for racing. First on the fearsome Österreich ring, then the shortened Red Bull ring. With its most recent reconstruction in late 2008, which incorporated a new pits and paddock complex at a reported cost to its Red Bull owners of 75 million US dollars. The iconic track was reopened in 2011, with Red Bull naturally pulling out all the stops and available machinery to relaunch the circuit. And Red Bull is the most successful at its own track, with Max Verstappen on top with four Austrian wins and another under the Styrian banner in 2021. Alain Prost is next on three, six drivers have two. Last year, the energy drinks brand sprung a big surprise on the Dutchman and AlphaTauri now RB's diminutive pilot Yuki Tsunoda ahead of the race, with a visit to an iron mine 45 minutes from the Styrian circuit. There, the pair were presented with branded monster trucks for a spin on a dirt course laid out at the bottom of the mine. Hopefully, I can reach the throttle. <laughs> I mean, I hope you can jump in. I know. <laughs> with his feet barely on the pedals, Tsunoda showed caution in qualifying, while Verstappen threw it to the wind and secured pole. But in the race, the Dutchman's truck hit reliability issues, which allowed Tsunoda to sail through to victory. Yeah, Max had a, was an amazing lap uh, in the quali. Uh, he was uh, three seconds ahead, and uh, I felt, OK, I need to maybe pu push more throttle. And um, I had a good start, um, and I used the momentum until the end. And um, unfortunately, he had a bit of misfiring. Verstappen, though, rated the monster truck experience. To be honest with you, driving like so high, I, it was quite comfortable in a way. I mean, of course, when you start pushing it, it starts to be a little bit more uncomfortable, but that's exactly how it, how it should be, right? Um, but yeah, it's definitely a bit different to a Formula 1 car. The circuit, though, has been most recently used as a test ground for F1 aspirants, with Alpine running Victor Martins and Kush Maney while Aston Martin handed the AMR22 to American driver Jack Crawford. The 19-year-old, who currently races an F2 for dams, completed more than 400 kilometers of running across both short and long stints to get to know the F1 car and tires better. Located 200 kilometers from Vienna, the 4.318 kilometer circuit has just 10 turns, three left and seven right, for a top speed of 330 kilometers per hour. Spaniard Carlos Sainz set the lap record in 2020 when he was with his former team McLaren. And there are three DRS activation zones, one between turns one and three, another between turns three and four, and one on the main pit straight. With only 10 of the last 19 Spielberg winners coming from pole position, it's anyone's game on the road to 2024's third sprint weekend in Austria. Thanks for watching. To stay up to speed on all things Formula One, make sure you hit the subscribe button.